probably know, I am one of the children's librarians here at Bartholomew County Public Library. And today I wanted to share one of my favorite children's books with you. Uh, this is called Little Witch Hazel, A Year in the Forest by Phoebe Wall. And it is just a beautiful, beautiful book. Um, so, a uh, quick summary of this book, um, it follows a little witch, little witch Hazel, who is very tiny, and um, it just follows her as she goes about her day-to-day -day life um, in her woodland home, helping other animals, making friends, um, you kind of get the idea. And as the subtitle suggests, um, the book covers a year in the forest, so it is actually four stories, one for each season. Um, summer, fall, winter, and spring. And I just love this book for so many reasons. The illustrations are beautiful. Um, they're very detailed. They're very colorful. They pop. Um, and there's always some new cute little detail I'm discovering every time I read it. And it kind of reminds me, in a way, of stories by Beatrix Potter. Um, or by Arnold Lobel of Frog and Toad, Wind in the Willows, uh, Winnie the Pooh, in that it has a very strong sense of place and a connection to nature. Um, but also it's a bit quirky um, in a cozy, homey sort of way. Um, and it just really, it speaks to a nostalgia I have for childhood, for that simple, profound sort of wisdom um, that it delivers. The writing is just beautiful and it pairs so well with the illustrations. The illustrations in this book are incredibly body positive. There are people of all shapes and sizes and abilities in this book and they're presented in a way that makes it just feel normal. Um, and I think that's really, really important um, and really essential for kids to see in stories that people look a lot of different ways um, and so can they. So I really appreciate that about this book. Um, I highly, highly recommend it obviously and uh, if you want to check it out, you can check it out in the children's department. Come tell me what you think afterwards.